whoa, you have never seen a fishing subscription box like this. So this is Fish Vault. Fish Vault's a family-owned, veteran-owned subscription brand focused on fishing gear. It was established back in 2019 by the team that developed Hunt Vault, which started back in 2015, the first ever hunting-specific subscription box. Now, this ain't your mama's fishing box where you're going to get like six or seven lures for $35 to $55. You're going to get lures. However, you're going to get a bunch of gear from brands like Garmin, Oakley, Columbia, Yeti. In fact, in my last box, I got this guy. The old Yeti Go box. This thing's freaking sweet. And other brands like Gerber, Leatherman, Pelican, 13 Fishing, and more. All right, let's open this bad boy up and see what we got inside. All right, see what we got here. First, we got Big Bite Baits. Got the four-inch crawl, green pumpkin, Texas red. Oh, let's see what this look like. Oh, nice. Those are extra long. Those are sweet. Oh, we got the three-inch crawl. I can definitely see using this size in the rivers. Ooh, Ooh, what we got okay, here? Bro. All right, we got the Bill Lewis Scope Stick 100. Look at that. Juicy. All right, so, so they say it's made for forward-facing sonar, and how they justify that is because of the flat sides. And so this is going to show up a lot better for your FFS, especially at long distance. And this bill, you guys see that? That is going to make this thing wobble from side to side. So if you're bringing it back towards your forward-facing sonar, it's going to flash the sonar with the sides, and it's going to show up at greater distances. So it's got a rattle and kind of a knock side by side. So definitely look forward to throwing this in the fall when I start bringing back back into the rotation, my jerk baits, and I believe this one is suspending. All right, what other juice have we got in here? Another big bite of baits. This is gonna be your watermelon seed five inch grub. Let's go and check that out. Oh yeah, juicy. I would probably throw this on like a ball head jig or something. And this is my favorite color. That's what catches them around here. So look forward to throwing that bad boy. I also got in here. Okay, the big bite baits. We got a DSJ, it looks like. Yep, quantity four pack. This is a 9 16th ounce. Let's go ahead and open this up, take a look at it. Let's see what I would use this for. These are heavy. Oh, nice. So these are gonna be really great for your really large, large worms, right? It's gonna be a good alternative to a peg Texas rig. And these are really strong mustad hooks. And so definitely legitimate. Nice. I don't have any of these, so look forward to throwing these guys. I Oh, check that out. An old timer electric fillet knife. Let's go and break this bad boy out. It comes with a sweet little case here, which is plastic on the outside, but on the back side, it's actually mesh. So after you get done like cutting fish up, uh, whatever you're filleting, it'll actually give it a little bit of breathing room to let it dry. Awesome. Oh, that is awesome. It has a couple of features on here has the green status bar for the power. It's lithium ion. It has a lock in here too, in case you're around kids. It's not gonna, not gonna go. Can't wait to fly something with this. So I don't love flaying fish, and the primary reason is it takes so freaking long, right? And so this guy right here, might do the trick. And lastly, we have, oh, ho, ho, from 13 Fishing. This is the Aerios spinning reel, size one. Let's go and open this bad boy up. So I love when you get a new reel. And it's just smooth like butter. So let me tell you about this reel. It's a size one, so it's gonna have a smaller capacity. You're gonna have, if you put eight pound test, which I'm going to do on this, you'll have a capacity of around 120 yards. Uh, the gear ratio on this bad boy is six, two to one. If you're new to fishing, that means every rotation of this handle like that, this will go around 6.2 times. So it's got a dead stop reverse. I can go this way, anywhere I try to go back, it does not let me move at all and it's also got this hybrid t-grip which i really like a lot of my other reels they're just round and every once in a while i fish in the rain these will slip off but this t-grip actually gives me something to hold on to so i like that design all right so you got a sealed rotor and you got cnc aluminum gear drives inside it's got nine total ball bearings which is why it makes it so smooth so this one has what's called a cool stop drag system so if you know anything about drag systems uh they've been made out of all kinds of stuff from leather to asbestos um some of the higher end ones are made out of carbon fiber however this one is made out of a special polymer and it actually has a beveled design which is pretty awesome so definitely looking forward to throwing this on one of my impulse rods and seeing how it compares to my lose hyper mag which i just got at the beginning of the season so granted the hyper mag cost about twice as much as this reel but nonetheless i look forward to doing a side-by-side -side comparison so if you're interested in a fishing gear box like this head over to fishvault.com and also if you're interested in learning more about that lose hyper mag reel i actually did a review on it and you can check that out right there thanks for watching Yes, see you.